Hello everybody, Grey Ghost here. Got a battle from my orc campaign for you. Versus a... Not quite a two full stacks, but two armies from the county of Everland. I'm currently... Uh, waging a wog against... Av Avalheim? I think. Whatever the capital of Averland is. Got a few goblins that I'm going to use as my meat shield. Place my orc spears behind them. off to the side. Double up over there. Us black orcs is ready for action, lads! Something to kill. There we go. That will do. into the woods over here. Fantastic. That's fine. Start everybody marching off in that direction and we'll go take a look at the Empire Army. Bowmen, help the deers, spears, swords, flagellants. The captain is in the sword unit. Nothing crazy. Should fall pretty quick. More flagellants over here in the woods. Now, onto the reinforcing army, which is actually the big one. Some handguns. Company Bowman, Free Company, Spears, Halberdiers, Cannons, Halberdiers, Spearmen, Walkers, Free Company, Swordsman. So again, nothing too crazy. and get pincered between the two. Look at the 
Higgins way. I am doing this in the moment, so if I trail off, I'm just trying to win. And here they come. Slight change of plan. Biggins are going in on the right. Now let these black orcs over here. Perhaps not my best strategy, but my way of thinking, I didn't want them to group up effectively.
I'm quite surprised that they're still going. surprised I did split my forces completely To be honest, this army really doesn't matter all that much. This is just a stack large meat shield, essentially. I'm sending these guys out ahead against the vanguard of Averland as we cross an Imperial territory. The real wog is with Grimgor Ironhide and his full stack of blackworks. And this body also has his immortal bodyguard. But they're still in the Badlands, making their way north. Until then, we'll slowly pick away at these stacks that show up. I guess that would be a hard fought battle regardless. Alright, let's show you all the campaign map. So you can see where the main body of the, the wog is. Ah! 
Gol Averheim. That's what it's called. I guess that makes sense. But yeah, from there we will be moving through this mountain pass here. But for now, everybody is going to meet around this city. After this guy ends up taking this Karak, he's going to join up on the log. And here is Grimgor and his friend. Watch me smash these puny squake brains! His friend has a pretty decent army. But Watch Grimgor, me smash these puny squake brains! Grimgor has a wonderful army. Some giants, some giant spiders, trolls, and tons of black orcs. And catapult, because why not? But from here, now that the wog is in full swing, I should be able to start outfitting a few of these guys here with hordes and just throwing them in. So I'm hoping to have maybe... at least four or five stacks to throw over here at Everheim. We shall see if it comes down to it, because the night goblins right now are at war with me. I saw there's a little half stack, but there's a full stack running around here somewhere, and that kind of makes me nervous, but I'm hoping to get a diplomat, a quote-unquote orc diplomat, over to them to kind of negotiate some peace. That way I don't have to worry about them. But up until then, I am Gregos, and I will catch you in the next one. Everybody have a good day.